So what I'm trying to say is like Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is so lenient on the woman than the male. The male you cannot look at all if there is no excuse. The excuse is what I've just mentioned. You're looking for wife, your doctor, or your judge, something like this. There is a necessity for you to look. But a female, although Allah SWT said in the Quran they cannot look. I mean they have to lower their gaze like man. But there are certain places in the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that shows, uh, shows us that the issue is not like the male. Aisha radiallahu anha, she came to the Prophet Sallallahu uh, Alaihi Wasallam. She was with the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the Abyssinian people from Habasha, they were playing their own games and she was watching them. And the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he was the one who let her do it and she actually put her hand on his shoulder. She was watching and the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was asking her, is it enough? Is that enough? She said, don't worry, still I want to watch. Can we do this to the brothers? You let the brother come female, they're playing football or something, you let the brothers? <laughs> I always ask this question, if you're going to be honest, if you're going to be honest, if you have, I mean male, they're playing football and you have a group of women they're watching, what are they watching? Honestly speaking, they're watching what? Football. The game. Yeah, they're watching the game. Have a sisters playing football and bring brothers watching. <laughs> what are they watching? They're watching the girls. No doubt. There will be no one who is going to watch the ball. They watch. That's why you will see if you are playing football, how many girls you will see surrounding you? One, two, three watching. If girls are playing football and, the, and it is halal for everyone to go, who is going to remain in this room? No one. That's so why one of our lecturers, he said, one of the reasons why Islam doesn't let women to make adhan is because of what? The voice. Come to the masjid in UI and some, sometimes you should see even the first line is not even full. Believe me, ask one of the sisters to make adhan. Even the non-believers will see them in the masjid. This is true. You will see everyone coming to see who is this. This is reality, this is fact. This is fact. So that's why uh, Islam, although there is a strong recommendation for them also to close their eyes, but the stress that Islam put on men is not the same stress that Allah SWT put on the sisters. What are the means of protection? I cannot look. This is what Allah SWT said. But sometimes, accidentally, I will look. How am I going to protect myself? There is only one way. This way lies on the way the woman is dressing, the way she appears. Because when you look at her, the first one, and the Prophet said, you have the first one, the second one is not yours. What does that mean? Some people, they say, oh, that's nice. I have the first one. That means when he looked at the first one, he would never stop looking. Because if he turns his eyes, that means he cancels the excuse. No, it doesn't mean like this. It means whenever you look accidentally, you have to turn quickly away. Then Allah SWT will forgive that uh, looking that you had. So, but the problem is, if the woman is not dressing properly, the attraction will be